Hey, welcome Scrum Masters. By now you should have looked at the big video for this week on daily, weekly, and monthly rhythms. In that video, I described 11 habits that you might want to adopt as part of your rhythms. One of those habits is called self-appreciation or gratitude. And this video is just a drill down of that particular habit. I'm just gonna illustrate how I do my appreciation I do this on a weekly basis. So I'm just going to spend a few minutes here talking through my appreciation for the last week. Now let me think. What I've been doing for the last week is primarily developing this Udemy course. I've also been doing my taxes. Uh, I went to a play and I have a meeting this week with a great friend of mine. So let me think about what appreciations I can think of around those topics. So. For the Udemy course, I'm really happy to be working with the Udemy folks. They're extremely helpful. So I have a lot of gratitude for the folks who are helping me at Udemy to develop this course. So I'm going to write that down as my first appreciation. I'm also really happy that I have this time in my schedule to create this course. So I'm happy that I've been able to create this space in my schedule to put together this course. So I'm going to write that down as my second appreciation. Let's turn now to taxes. So I've been doing my taxes now for three months and I'm on the fourth round of conversations with my accountant. She asks me questions and I respond to them. And I'm really thankful for the way that she asks those questions. She's always very clear. She's unemotional. She doesn't yell. So I'm going to write my third appreciation around that. Oh, I just actually thought of something else. Uh, I just started making juices this week, vegetable juices, fruit juices. And that's been a lot of fun. So I'm really happy that I discovered that. So I'm going to write that down as my fourth appreciation. I'm meeting with my friend Barbara this weekend. I always enjoy talking to Barbara. So I'm going to write that down as my fifth appreciation. And then I visited a play last weekend and I discovered a new theater actor who I think is just absolutely phenomenal. It was a play about Kafka and he played the leading role and it was just amazing. So I'm really happy to have discovered a new actor. So I'm going to write that down as my sixth appreciation. So let me see if there's anything else here. Let me just pause a moment. So I'm, I'm very happy and I'm very content right now in my life. And I'm very well rested. I'm energetic. I'm enthusiastic. So I'm going to appreciate that as well. So I'm going to end with my appreciation with those seven items. So I've got them listed here just by bullet points, just a few words for each one. At the top now, I'm just going to write appreciations for this week. And I'll go ahead and file this in a notebook with all of my appreciations. So that just like concludes the drill down into appreciation. So now I'll say a few words about it. This is something that I do on a weekly basis. And I just sit down just like I did here with you for 10 to 15 minutes, look over the past week and write down the things that I'm grateful for. Second, there's a lot of evidence that this exercise is very life affirming and increases connections with ourselves and with others. And thirdly, this is a suggestion something that you can do if you want, if you think it helps you, if you think it supports you, but you don't have to do it. It's just one of the 11 habits that I discussed, and this is a specific example of how I do it. 